hey guys welcome to my channel this is Egda income with Charlie uh, today I'm gonna to be sharing some wonderful stuff with us first of all if you did parabola when I posted it the interaction and the form filling your result is how so you can take the time to search for your result here to check if you actually qualified for it so there are three different categories here the uh, what the people getting uh, half I mean like three different rounds all right so different unit so you can just search for your address here and if you qualify well that's actually a good news you wait for their main net launch and you cash out your unit into your own personal eligible account so that is the first thing I have for you so oh by the way I have a very new system for you on Puka dot using Puka dot wallet so if you are new to excuse me if you are new to all this polka dot thing so you can just search this on google search polka dot extension on google then hard from chrome set up your wallet and you are done so once you are done setting up your wallet you should have something like you should have something like this yeah you should have something like this just make sure that you allow or use on any chain for this particular head drop you understand that so once you are done you can now come back to this interaction this is testnet.fxtx.finance on poker dot so we are going to be you doing, doing some basic stuff there we are going to be authorizing we are going to be well let me just do it right away so that i won't have to explain all of them so the first thing that you're going to be needing is getting file set that's quite very important and always remember i had all my links on my description you just have to check them and use them accordingly so the first thing you're going to be doing the main thing here we are going to be interacting on the on both the the dex the decentralized exchange and the and decentralized exchange both of them you are going to be interacting with them so we are going to be working on getting file set first so where's the file set so you can get the file set anywhere let's see okay if you if you need the file set come here come to app.bootcard.fusoto.org it's going to be in the description like i said then paste the tweet link which contains your polkadot account so you can just do it this way let me teach you how you're going to do that i have my twitter account here so i'm going to be pasting the sample here on the description here is what you are going to be copying and pasting on your own twitter account and you tweet but there's there's going to be a little different which is your wallet address here you remember the wallet address on your poker dots that's what you're going to be pasting here but mind you make sure that these brackets are here they are there you, you just need to take out your address and you are good to go i mean just change the address and paste it that's as simple as that then when you paste it you can come here copy link to tweet then now it's this uh where's the host in the key? you can now paste the whole tweet link here then click on give me towel you can see you had you had got some tokens today so i've got some tokens today and i'm not supposed to do that again anyway so now let's go to the real business i have my my wallet mommy my, my towel inside the wallet I mean uh, in the wallet so I now want to interact with this uh, platform fxdx.finance it's actually a test nothing thing so you're just going to be working on some few testing and the likes so um, the first thing you are expected to do here is you got to connect your wallet okay <laughs> so this is auto connected already but you got to connect your wallet in every decentralized exchange or centralized exchange or the, whatever it is whatever it is nothing just make sure that you get to you know uh connect to your wallet first i'm actually waiting for the network to load up so i'm waiting for the network to load up i don't know why second time Okay, so I just figure out that uh, you know. So okay, let me get to connect my wallet here. 
okay then after i did connect my wallet i can come here authorize authorize any amount i want to authorize i know i cannot i can authorize 40 so authorize in this sense actually mean you are depositing you understand that it means you are depositing nothing else so then after okay let me just wait for this transaction to seal off and um uh, and i finish this Okay, so uh, I have deposited some amount here. Then I can come to assets to confirm that you can see I have a total of 119 here and I can trade. I can trade any amount. If I had USDT before, I can trade this for more tau. Do I have USDT before? I think I do. So let me trade for more tau tau i think i do right okay so order accepted and you can see the orders now all right so you can create some buy actions too or some buy functions to just make sure that you interact with the whole thing yeah, just make sure that you interact with the whole thing much about that you can see all that accepted look at it still on field though maybe because of the price but the order is accepted you can cancel the order if you want i don't want to want anybody to get confused here anyway so the main goal here is just make sure that you interact with the platform nothing else and you have to authorize first before you perform any trade that you want to perform i hope you will be all understand that yeah you just you, you just do that so once you do that you can now come here and revoke the houses or some houses based on any amount that you want to revoke make sure this is a compulsion here is a requirement here make sure that you revoke out uh, at least once all right it's very important make sure you revoke at least one if it, if it doesn't work once you may need to try it later okay so for this part now i did three simple things first of all i connected my wallet that's quite simple okay transfer fail then two i made authorization after making authorization i made a trade then after the trade i revoked i tried to revoke so it's currently writing fail but you can actually try that one later anyway so then I can now come back to stake and recovery, or I mean stake and rewards. So on this particular uh, page here, I'm actually going to be staking and claiming the rewards of my staking. Make sure that you get connected, all right? That's the most important thing right away. So the set minimum of staking is 100. So I have 259 tau, as you can see it. So I'm going to be staking 100 tau so i'm just waiting for this to be done in few seconds and i go to the next one so you just have to wait for that oh transfer failure i don't know what's happening to their platform today I don't know why some of all these errors are coming here, but you can always try it. Even if it doesn't work now, try your best to make sure that you, you know, try some of all these things. All right. So after you are done with your staking, you can now come to trading rewards. Okay, you can claim here, then come to transfer failure. I think something is down with uh, with the platform right away, so we can do uh, many of all these things for now, but. I, I will just get to show you what is needed so then you can now come to reward you will get some tau here make sure you claim the tau 
once again let me make it very simple you get your file set after you get your file set you come to the this platform fxdx.finance i'm going to be putting that in our in our description and um you call co you connect your wallet authorize trade and revoke once you're done with this part then you you come to assets here then make sure that you stick and you claim the word if this video is very clear for you well you can toggle on the subscription button and share to guys out there so that they can have wonderful information in their doorstep all right thanks for watching guys god bless you